hello dominance i know i've been missing in action and i know you guys miss me so much by the grace of god i'm done with my exams and we're on vacation now so yes i got lots of videos for you guys so today i'm just going to show you something very simple i know we all are familiar with fried rice jollof and all that okay i'm just going to show you another way you can cook your rice for this christmas two different ways even though they are similar there are so many ways you can cook them you can also add your twist yes but i'm just showing you the basic okay yeah so let's just get straight into the video so my ingredients are spaghetti rice chopped garlic guys the chopped garlic is optional but trust me it adds flavor and also some onions and I also have some curry and then oil. If you don't have curry, you can use turmeric, okay? Yes. Okay, so my dominant, I'm cooking two variants, okay? One with curry and the other without curry. Yes. And also, I'm using vermicelli pasta. That's a spaghetti. But if you don't have this, you can use the normal spaghetti and then break it into pieces okay yeah so we're going to fry our spaghetti for some time some people usually fry their onions before adding their spaghetti to it i think it's it's not advisable to do it that way because um the onions get burnt okay you know when onions get burnt it gives your food a better taste so i'll suggest you first of all fry your spaghetti then when it is almost at the color you want then you add your onions so that it will fry together with the onions i hope you understand so your onions are still fresh and do not get burnt i also added my garlic whilst adding the onions like i said at the beginning it is very optional okay it just adds flavor to the food and we also know that garlic has a lot of health benefits you can check it out from google <laughs> So you add your rice when your spaghetti gets to the desired color you want. This is the color I want, okay? So you can decide to fry more if you want it a bit darker than this. But this is the color I prefer. So yeah, basically that is it. Very simple. After pouring your rice, you stir for some time. You have to like, should I say toast? Yeah, you toast it for some time. Then you add your water and salt. Then that is it very very simple and easy guys trust me you can do this So my dominant, I already started with the curry one at the other end. Yes, so I just added my spaghetti to the oil just like the previous one. So yeah, just let's continue from here. Yeah. This particular one is similar to what we did previously. The only difference is that I'm going to add curry like I told you. This is just to give it a different color from the previous one. Yeah. guys we are seven days away from christmas you can add this recipe to your menu for christmas guys trust me this recipe is amazing it smells good already like the onions the mixture of onions garlic the spaghetti itself like when i was frying just the spaghetti huh the aroma was something else guys yes this goes well with almost everything since it's just like braised rice. If you're a Ghanaian, you know what we call anguamu. It's just like it. The difference is that this one is with spaghetti. You can eat it with grinded pepper or even shito. Or with a nice beef sauce. Or better still, it goes well with soup, guys. Seriously, yes, it goes well with soup. So it's your choice, okay? You can add this to your Christmas menu. 
guys so aside the fact that this is a type of rice you know sometimes saying eh, you have rice and then you also have spaghetti but you just want to cook just rice and you know that the rice wouldn't be enough okay the quantity you want wouldn't be enough if you have spaghetti somewhere you can try this method with it okay instead of cooking the rice and then cooking the spaghetti separately like the old school way you know what i mean yeah let's just add a little twist to our dishes okay yeah very simple this is not anything big but then when you cook it for somebody the person will appreciate it better than rice and spaghetti guys our white one it's almost ready at this point if you do not like the texture you can sprinkle some brine solution okay you know some people like their rice very soft it all depends on you okay and this is also our curry braised rice yes i really love this color you can actually use turmeric like i said turmeric will make it very yellow okay this one is not too yellow but then the curry gives it some kind of taste so that's why i like the curry yeah so you just make your choice very simple Finally, fam, we've come to the end of this wonderful video. I know you will definitely try this recipe. Okay, you need this on your dinner tables. Thank you so much for watching. God bless you. Have a lovely weekend. Please don't forget to like this video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed yet. And share this video to your family and friends. Thank you. See you in my next video. Bye.